In Washington state, agribusiness companies and food manufacturers are pouring millions of dollars into an effort to defeat what could become the country's first law requiring the labeling of genetically modified foods and seeds. Washington residents will vote on Initiative 522 on November 5th. But companies opposed to labeling are funding a more than $17 million effort to derail it. Monsanto donated nearly $5 million, and DuPont has given more than $3 million, while Pepsi, Coca-Cola and Nestle have dedicated more than a $1 million each. Labeling supporters have raised less than a third of their opponents. Their largest donor is Dr. Bronner's Magic Soaps. A recent New York Times poll found 93 percent of Americans want labels on food containing GMOs. 64 countries require it. Meanwhile, legislators on one Hawaiian island recently passed their own bill restricting pesticide use by companies developing GMOs. Because of its location, Kauai has become a hotspot for new genetically modified crops, particularly corn, which is grown by companies including DuPont, Syngenta and Dow. But residents say pesticides from the fields are making them sick. Last week, the Kauai County Council passed a measure that requires the companies to disclose which pesticides they use and establishes buffer zones around medical facilities, schools and homes.